And so we also come today in a difficult environment to dream. But I invite you to dream nonetheless. We want to be at the same time completely fully Muslims and completely and fully Americans. Is this possible? The uh, Boston uh, Islamic Seminary is saying yes. We, and we need to provide the right education to do this. I'm very happy to join the board and I, I have been involved in thinking about it before even joining the board in uh, 2017. So now for me it's a, it's a project where I'm not only a member of the board, I want to share views, I want to think about building the institution and, and, and getting it right from the very beginning. And we need our sisters and our brothers to study here in seminaries and in training schools taught by people of this land to the people of this land. And no society will ever flourish Islamically when it is outsourcing its scholarship to another land. You need to insource our scholarship. And Alhamdulillah, there is much going on even here in Boston. There's talk of a seminary. This organization and the mission and the goal to prepare workers who are there to be the shoulder to lean on spiritually for individuals is absolutely imperative. What we have to answer is, if we don't build the seminary, who will? I truly think that 10, 20, 30 years from today, when people look back at defining uh, moments or defining institutions or defining projects that have geared the Muslim community in a more positive direction, I believe that the Boston Islamic Seminary is, with the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, going to be one of these projects. Please, please support Boston Islamic Seminary. The Prophet wasallam said, there are only three good types of people in the dunya. This is in the Sahih. The student of knowledge, the teacher of knowledge, or the one who supports them. If your students, mashallah, if your teachers, mashallah, if you're neither of those, please elect to be a part of the third category.